What's up everybody? I just wanted to do a quick video. I know there's a lot of comments out there about uh, how as an Amazon influencer that if I go and I get a dot live, my show dot live, how do I take or what is the URL that I need to direct all of the traffic to? So if it's my show dot live and I say, hey, I'm going live on Amazon, go to my show dot live. What exactly, where exactly are we sending them? Are we sending them to our shop? Are we sending them to that particular show? So as you know, every time you set up a show as an Amazon Live influencer, they give you a new URL, obviously. So instead of going in there every single time and changing the URL for that, it's probably better for you to pick one URL that is more like as close as a YouTube channel for a Amazon Live creator, which is what Jim and I have done for Dealcasters um, dot live. So I just wanted to, and those of you who are at this point are like, what the heck is he talking about? I just want to tell you really quickly, um, you can get your own dot live. Um, it's it's really easy. Uh, it's a dollar ninety nine, less than a cup of coffee, and this is something that Jim and I truly believe in. We've done it for our live show. We've done it for our shops. So we bought dot dot shop. We bought dot academy. We bought dot university. Those are all like a dollar ninety nine. And the way for you to get your own dot live is to go to name dot com slash live, and then the uh, promo code is get live. And uh, you can get your show dot live, and it's really easy. I'm gonna show you how to do it. And as an Amazon Live influencer, you can do it yourself um, relatively easy. Show. So here's how we do this on Dealcasters. So this is obviously the the Dealcasters um, shop page, and instead, um, and so here's the URL that we use. So instead of sending them to this shop that everyone is familiar with and saying, oh, here that is, you know, we said, okay, we're gonna buy dealcasters.shop. So if somebody wants to look at any of these things, idealists or, um, you know, product videos or any of these things that we have, we're gonna send them to the shop. But if, if we say, this is our dot live, this is when we're going live, or if you don't catch it, you can still catch it on the replay. Amazon on the shop page, buries this all the way at the bottom where your live streams are. And so here is our latest live stream uh, that we have. But not only that is this little link that's up here in the upper right hand corner that says view all my past live streams. So what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna right click with my mouse and I'm gonna copy that link. So right now I have that link. And the reason why I'm, I'm directing dealcasters.live and the reason why I would suggest that you direct your dot lives there is because when you click on that, that is always gonna be your latest live show. So this was the latest live show that we went. Obviously we're not live right now, so this is showing previously live. Um, so if someone clicks on something, they're going to be like, um, okay, I want a show. If you send them to a shop, that's a bad experience. And so send them to a show because this show is also a shop, right? If they hit play and they start clicking around here, this is also a shop. And so this not only is just a shop, but it also has all of your previous episodes as an Amazon Live content creator. So maybe they're clicking on a link that is a previous show like this one. And if it's a previous show like this one, then they can find it relatively easily, almost like you would find something on a YouTube channel. So for us, it is that link that you find all the way at the bottom of your shop page. In the upper right hand corner at the bottom, it says view um, all past live streams. That's the one you wanna use, so we like to copy that, copy it to your clipboard. So now what do you do with it? Now that you have that on your clipboard, how do you redirect it in your name.com uh, uh, account. So what you do at this point is you go to your name.com account. And so let me go right now to the main page. So this is your, your name.com account. And so go to my domains, which you'll see right here. Um, you click on my domains 
And this is just an example because dealcasters.live is not on this account for me, but we're just gonna click on Dealcasters University and we're gonna say, okay, this is where we're gonna redirect this link. So under my domains and quick links, you'll see URL forwarding. Click on URL forwarding. And once you do that, you click on edit because you wanna forward it to that link you just copied from uh, your shop page that says view my all past, view my past all live streams or whatever it says. So go and hit edit. And then right here in forward, select all of that, then paste that new URL into that, click update and boom. Now, anytime someone types in, in this case, dealcasters.university, they're gonna go to that URL. It was that easy. So I hope that helps you. I hope that, you know, maybe works with you. And so, you know, the thinking here is until Amazon gives us some new spot, some better spot, perhaps, that uh, works for you as a content creator to say, hey, go catch me live here. Um, that's the best one that's worked for us. It's helped us in terms of SEO. It's helped us in terms of being easy to be for us to be able to say it in a clubhouse room and Twitter spaces room and all of these audio apps and our podcasts and everything else. So, uh, please let me know if that helps you. And, uh, as always, don't fear the gear.